everyone, and today I'm going to show you how to turn this into this. So today I'll be showing you how to scale down your Kashyyyk ATRT using the same pieces as it, and this is from set 75261 from 2019, the 20th anniversary Kashyyyk ATRT. This one is a bit big and it's quite inaccurate because it should be about this tall compared to a figure. And so we're going to show you how you can scale this down using the same pieces to make a more accurate and better version of the Kashyyyk ATRT. So first what you're going to want to do is take apart your Kashyyyk ATRT completely and then we'll lay out our pieces and show you what pieces you will need. So now I have disassembled the ATRT and I have gotten all the pieces that we need. There are a bunch of extra pieces which is a pretty big pile over here as you can see but um, I will just be using these ones. So uh, I will also be using for this uh, build these two pieces as well this small claw silver claw piece and this one technique piece these are both pretty common pieces so they shouldn't be too e too hard to find so the first step for doing this build is to build the legs so the first thing we will be doing is putting together these two and then these two then we will be folding them across and sticking this in here and this in here so there's the majority of the legs then we get these two pieces and stick them on top see one there and one here so and now we build the feet to build the feet it's pretty simple you get this here uh, you get one of these here. You get one of these. Stick it right across the bottom there. You get one of these studs. Stick it on the bottom. See stud. Oops, stud, like so. Then you get one of these um, green pieces and stick it there. So that's the first foot. And then we do the opposite thing. So this, and then this and this, this, this. So that's the first two feet, or the only two feet. I stick them on the legs, and now we've got the full legs that the walker will be walking on. Set those aside. I'll build the full front part of the uh, walker. So to do this, I'll start with a 2x4. Is um, one of these black pieces here and on top of this I will be sticking this piece right here which is this one piece on the side then I stick that right on there tight fit and then um, I will need two studs stick them on top of each other and this piece the technique uh, pin and I stick them right in here, which will create the gun. Uh, so with this, I uh, grab one of these and stick it right on here, but up one, see like that. Then I stick this on there, see like that. And then I get this whole big piece and stick it right here, like that. Then what I'm going to want to do is get this piece and stick it on there, like so. Then I get these two uh, curved or sloped grill pieces and stick them on both sides of this, like that. And then behind this, what I am going to want to do is put these pieces, see, on each side. I'm going to want to put these and these as well. Um, That's pretty simple. So that is the whole top bit. Next, so now to build the body, you're gonna gonna want to get a two by four. Stick two two by twos on the bottom. Then get this, these two one by twos, and these two pieces which will connect to the legs. Then we get these two pieces, like so, which will connect to the um, to the side bits. 
and then on top of this, get this two by two, stick it right on there. Now then we get one of these pieces and stick it right down the center there. Then we get these pieces, these jumper plates, stick them down the middle. Then I'm gonna get these one by threes right there, stick them right down. Then I need uh, one of these one by two bits, stick that right there. Then this bit, which will connect to the jumper plates. Then um, one of these jumper plate bits on top of there. Then this brick. Or no, no, no. Uh, then another one of these green bricks. Then this brick. And then you're going to want to get the um, handlebar piece with a jumper plate and a clip. And stick that right on top. Then for the back, what you're going to want to do is get this 2x2 two two right there. Then these 1x1 one uh, one stud pieces right in the front. Then this piece right in the front. Then we're going to build the back part. Stick this piece on. Um, so you're going to want these two clip pieces stick them right through these holes. It's very similar to the one that comes in the set, but slightly different. It's like so. Then on top of that, stick this and this piece. And then the horn piece, which is isn't from the set. It just makes it more pointy and look better because we don't want the really long one that comes in the set. So then you clip that on at the back and stick this back on. Okay, so now that I've got that, uh, we're going to want to do the sides. To do those, you're just going to want to get this on both sides. And then stick these like so. Then these two things like so. Now you got all that. Now we get this and stick this right in the center there. See, now we've got the whole front of it. <clears throat> Next, we're going to want to put on the legs. Click. Click. And then there, now we've got our um, walker. So I accidentally got too many of these pieces, so I'll set them aside and grab one of my troopers. So yeah, this is how you build this walker. Uh, it's much more of a um, accurate size uh, if you compare it to a person standing so I'll grab my other trooper so you can see it's much more accurate it is still a bit big as you can see but it's hard to get it much smaller especially with the leg pieces that come in the set um, so yeah that is how to build this um, ATRT uh, and make it more accurate and small. Thank you for watching this video and please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and um, please check out our channel if you want to see lots more videos like this. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you next time on Sanders 3 Lego. Bye!